Hi hello and welcome to Positivity with Crochet. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to crochet this simple cross. So let's begin with a magic circle. Once the magic circle is ready, we will chain 3. 1, 2 and 3. After chaining 3, we need to work double crochet inside the magic circle to double crochet, yarn over, pull through, pull through first 2 loops and pull through the next 2 loops. This is one double crochet. And first three chains will be considered as one double crochet so work one more double crochet after this chain three after chaining three we need to work three double crochet in the same magic circle one two and this is the third double crochet now you can grab this tail hold it and pull it so that the gap is little now chain three one two and three after this again work Three double crochet in the same magic circle. So after this, we will chain three. And we will repeat the same that is three double crochet in the same magic circle Now chain 3 and slip stitch on to the third chain here to join the round. Now you can see we have done this square, this part. Now we will be working on this part. So to work there we need to reach to the third three chain space. So to reach there we will slip stitch once, slip stitch twice. So we have reached here to the three chain space. Now first we will chain three and in the same space we will work two double crochet. This is one double crochet and in the same space one more double crochet. After this first three chains will be considered as one double crochet. Now chain three and two double crochet. Now one double crochet. This is my second double crochet. Now chain three. Sorry. Now chain 3 and slip stitch onto the same space here. After this, okay this is how it looks like now. You can see we have done with this part. So we are going to work on this part now. 
so now we need to reach to the next three chain space so we need to slip stitch three times to reach it to that three chain space this is one slip stitch two and three slip stitches so now we will work three chains two double crochet in the same space After two double crochet, chain three, after chaining three, two double crochet in the same space, this is one, this is my second double crochet, after this chain three, one, two and three, after chaining three, slip stitch onto the same space this is how it looks like now now again to reach to the next chain space we need to slip stitch three times how we did it earlier now chain three two double crochet again three chains after this again two double crochet now chain three and slip stitch into the same space So this is how it looks like. Now again slip stitch three times to, jo to go and reach to the next three chain space. Yes we have done till here. This is how we have finished. You can see here we have finished the top part of the cross. Now we will be working on the bottom part. So chain three. We will repeat the same pattern that is two double crochet again three chains two double crochet after that again chain three and slip stitch into the same space After we have done this, we are going to flip our work or we turn our work and chain one. You can chain one and then turn as well. But I am going to flip first and then chain one. Now, we need to slip stitch four times. This is one. This is two times. This is the third slip stitch and this is the fourth slip stitch to reach this chain space. Now we will repeat the pattern that is three chains, two double crochet, again three chains, two double crochet. now chain 3 and slip stitch into the same space now chain 1 and turn your work now as we did it earlier again to reach to the next chain space here we made we need to slip stitch four times one 
two, three, and four. So you can see here, this is how it looks like. Now only one last part is left, this one. So we will work on that now. So chain three, again two double crochet in the same space. Chain three, again two double crochet. three chains now slip stitch into the same space now you can finally chain one pull the yarn tight and cut the yarn off you can weave in these extra ends here behind so finally these beautiful cross are ready so if you like this tutorial, please do like my video and mention it in the comments box below. If you haven't subscribed my channel, please do consider subscribing my channel. And thank you for watching.